What's going on, everybody? Everybody's talking about this new Google cybersecurity certification program. In this video, we're going to dive into exactly what it entails and what you have to do to complete it. But stick around because I'm going to answer the question, is it enough to get a job after you're done? For those of you that are new to the channel, my channel is all about IT education. So if you're interested in that and you want a practical way to learn IT while having some fun at the same time, if you like this video, of course, subscribe down below and uh, comment down and let me know your name and maybe we can uh, spin up some conversation also. So what is the Google Cybersecurity Certification Program? Now, from what I'm seeing, this is a great program for beginners, for sure. And what you're looking at is about six months worth of courses. There's gonna be eight courses in this program, um, each of them having their own set of time uh, to complete. Now, the good thing about this program that I like is that you get a seven day free trial to go through some of the modules and kind of check out to see if this something that looks like a good fit for you. If it's not after before seven days, you will be able to cancel your membership to the Google program and you will get your money back in return. So another thing that's pretty cool about this is this is kind of a pay by month um, kind of educational course. And you're seeing a lot of different um, educational entities starting to do this where it's on your time and you pay a monthly cost and then um, you can complete the course how fast or how slow you would like. So for this particular course, it's $50 a month and they, uh, they say six months because they assume that within six months, at, I believe they said seven hours a day, you'll be able to complete this certification in full. Now, if you're a fast learner, and what's cool about this certification program is that you don't have to wait six months. If you complete it in four months, then you're good to go. If three months, you're good to go. It doesn't matter. You're still paying $50 a month. So if you pay $50 for three months, you only paid $150 for this course, which I think is a steal. Now, if you are somebody where you think maybe you're gonna drag this out for a year, maybe consider your other options because at this point, you're now gonna be spending far, far more on this certification program. So guys, Amcrest sent me out this five megapixel digital security camera. Maybe it's something that you'd be interested in for your home. I'm gonna see if it's something that I would like for my home. Let's unbox it really quick and look at some of the features. The one thing I would say about this camera, it feels premium. The It is a full metal casing and nothing about it feels cheap and I feel like it will weather the storms uh, fairly well. This is where we have our ports to plug it in and this is the camera itself. Uh, it's got a nice um, camera as well as a light. Like I said, at nighttime it looks great and this is where you can use this diagram to mount the camera uh, perfectly. Overall, very nice material very nice finish and fit for sure. So some of the great features of the camera was that it's got a five megapixel camera lens, which is great for uh, video quality. I have a few ring devices and they're only two megapixels. So this camera is noticeably better in that area. It's also got some uh, motion detection features that can detect cars as well as auto tracking. It also gives off a nice uh, light at night uh, to keep intruders away from your home, let them know that this area is lit up and you can't, you know, come up here in the dark, right? So there's a lot of benefits to the camera. The one downside that I did not like particularly, and I don't think it's a deal breaker, is the application itself. It is a little bit non-intuitive for me. Um, it was it was kind of uh, rough for me to get you know 
in, adjusted to it and um but overall the camera is a great product i think that uh Amcrest is doing a great job with them um i'd actually like to see um what the 4k camera looks like as well at this point uh, i do have another couple of spaces around my house that i could uh integrate one of these cameras so guys if you're interested in a security camera i'd say that this is a great option and that you should check out Amcrest. So just to give you a better understanding of what the seven day free trial offers you, you're gonna get unlimited access to all the courses in the specialization. You get to watch lectures, participate in discussions and other things. The good part is you can cancel at any time, no penalties, you get your money right back. Um, like I said, $50 per month to continue learning. The faster, the better. The slower, probably not the best. Of course, they like to leave that part out. Um, and when you're done with this, they enable you to be able to share your resume on LinkedIn and obviously put your resume on other platforms as well. So here's another thing that I thought was particularly interesting when I was looking over this course. You're going to see that there is a question that is answered on their page. Will completing the certificate premier, excuse me, prepare me for the CompTIA Security Plus exam? I don't think a lot of people are looking at the certification in that light um, like it would be a precursor to the Security Plus exam. And that is a little bit what we're going to be talking about here. I'm starting to get the feel that a lot of people are thinking that this certification is going to be the end all be all. Um, maybe it's being promoted at that. But if you look in their documentation, you start to see things like this. And then you see their response here where it says the Google Cybersecurity Certificate helps prepare you for the CompTIA Security Plus exam. Now, to me, that sounds more like this is a precursor, right? This isn't going to just, um, you know, make you automatically a cybersecurity professional. It's really, really, really gonna help you though, for sure. Um, we just need to set the standard right there. And I'm not gonna, you know, inflate you guys' you know, um, ambitions, thinking that when you're done with this, that you, you know what I mean, that's it. You don't have to do anything else. Of course, that's not the answer. Now, as long as we understand that, let's look into this certificate a little bit more. So taking a little bit more of a deep dive through this course, it is on Coursera. Uh, this is a popular, popular website that provides a lot of different courses out there. Highly recommend it. Now here you could see it says beginner level, right? This is for no experience necessary. Um, this is the kind of certification. If you're getting your foot right off the ground, this is something that you want to do. Right. So it say you're in a IT help desk position, gaining some experience or you're in a university getting a degree. This is a great thing to pursue on the side for sure. Now, is this going to replace those things? No, but it definitely will help. You're going to get six months, like I said, at seven hours a week. If you do more than seven hours, then you'll complete it faster. Now, what's interesting here is what are some of the outcomes for this right they're saying that you get to connect with some hiring organizations like google salesforce adobe etc right down here is where you're going to get your courses there's eight courses like i mentioned before what i like about this certification is this i've heard a lot of flack about this and frankly i can have my own opinion you can have your own opinion this is important this is important, let me say it again. They dive down and drill into networks and network security. This is gonna give you a fundamental knowledge of networking to booster you in your career. 100%, 100% need this, and this is awesome. You're gonna get some um, Linux experience, which is great. You're gonna, Linux is a common operating system that's used in cybersecurity. Um, a lot of the commands are also found in um, other operating systems that maybe you wouldn't think of, like switching and routing. Um, you're gonna get some training on vulnerabilities, threats, how to detect them, how to respond to them. Great tool here to learn automating with Python. Um, that is a great, great thing to have under your belt when it comes to cybersecurity. Now, this is what's a little bit interesting, right? 
They tell us that they're going to um, allow you to engage with the cybersecurity community, find and apply for jobs. You're going to prepare for job interviews. This will be interesting to see exactly what they want or what they will give from this. Um, this, you know, it sounds like it's they're kind of, you know, overshooting here when it comes to preparing for job interviews and, and on applying for security jobs. But we'll see. Now, this this I would like to see what they're going to do with. Right. They're saying they're going to get you, you know, find you. This is find right out cybersecurity jobs. Now, what does that mean? I can find you cybersecurity jobs. Are you going to get in is the better question. And that's something that we're going to talk about um, coming up next. Is this going to be something that you do and you're ready to go? So this is another, um, you know, point to my last point about finding some kind of jobs. I found this interesting. They say that um, titles for graduates can include cybersecurity analysts, um, SOC analysts, security analysts, um, cyber defense analysts, right? So here is my take on that. It can definitely prepare you, right, for these positions. Now, to say you're just going to get into these positions from this um, program, frankly, I don't think that is the truth. Um, and that is my personal opinion. But overall, this certificate program is great for beginners. This is going to get you started in cybersecurity in a holistic matter that's going to introduce you to networking and a lot of other fundamental skills, as well as learning attack vectors, vulnerabilities, and how to defend against such threats. Now, what everybody's been waiting for, is this certification a good certification to get? Yes, it definitely is a great certification to get. Now, there are some things that need to be mentioned about the certification. Are these educational courses that you go through during the certification transferable in the real world? Absolutely. Everything that I've seen in here is going to 100% prepare you for a cybersecurity position. If you're new into the IT world and you're looking for something that is a full holistic course that can teach you A to Z um, at a basic level, this course is for you as long as you don't take a long time learning um, different courses because if you go over that six months mark now you're pushing four or five hundred dollars for the course I don't think it's worth it at that price that's just my personal opinion is this course gonna get you a role in cybersecurity I told you at the beginning of the video that we'd go into this and I'm gonna give you my honest opinion about it I do not think this alone is enough to get a job in cybersecurity it's just not now, if you combine this with a degree that you're working on, or you combine this with um, IT help desk experience or any type of IT experience that you can get into, yes, 100%, this is gonna help you get a job in cybersecurity with those things alone i do not personally think so and that's just my personal opinion so if you're somebody that has no prior experience no certifications no degree and you're looking at this certification understand yes it's going to help you but it's not going to just get you a job into cybersecurity. You're going to have to kind of bring in, you know, the education or some experience to mix in with that on your resume. Now, guys, this is just my personal experience with the field, right? Um, these certifications are becoming more frequent um, and they're great, but I do think that the fundamental requirements to get into these roles is still valid and is still used by a lot of HR. So like I said, get this. This is great to have, get it. But please understand that you still do need other things alongside of it on your resume.
Guys, I hope I gave you a great view of this certificate program and helped to make your decision a little bit better. Uh, there are a hundred different voices out there on the internet, so uh, I understand that it can get kind of you know nerve wracking when you're trying to pick a course. Uh, so I hope that I was able to break this one down for you and to give you my personal opinion. And uh, hopefully you can take that and make your decision um, better than you were able to before you started watching this video. Guys, I'll catch you in the next video. And for now, that's all I got. I'll see you later.